find the domain and range for the function f of x is 1 over x plus 2. Now, before we actually draw the graph, is there a value of x that you cannot put into this function and get an answer? Maybe pause the video for a moment and have a think about it and see if you could, you can um, come up with the solution for yourself. So drawing the graph, okay, here is the graph of the function. Now notice that you should have realized that x plus 2 cannot be equal to zero because you cannot divide by zero and therefore x cannot be equal to minus two because if you put minus two in here you get minus two plus two which is zero now that indicates that this uh, you should really put a dotted line on the graph at x is equal to minus two which is this point here and this spotted line has a special name, which is probably not going to be needed at IGCSE, but x is equal to minus 2. It's called a vertical asymptote. Okay, they're normally put in on a, as a, dot, a dotted line, unless they're actually on the axis. So, the domain will be x, such that x is not equal to minus 2, and x is a real number. For the range is a set of values that you're going to get out. Now, you might have noticed by looking at the graph, because look here and here, you can see that the curve is never going to cut the line y is equal to 0 or the x-axis. So because it doesn't matter what value of x you take, 1 over x plus 2 will never be equal to 0. This is perhaps something you should learn and try to realise for yourselves. So y is equal to 0 is called a horizontal asymptote. We don't put a dotted line there because it's on the axis. And therefore, the range is every value of y, but y not equal to 0, where y is a real number. OK, this has been a video to show you how to find the domain and range for a reciprocal function. I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.